Children as young as nine have been given puberty blockers in Scotland's Gender Identity Clinic, a review by NHS clinicians has revealed. Their report stated nearly two-thirds of children referred to the NHS Sandyford Clinic experienced autism or mental health conditions such as anxiety and depression. But in a leaked recording, a senior consultant clinical psychologist admitted its methods are not backed by robust evidence. It's not a forensic assessment where you're looking at social work and school and all of those things. You're basically just going on what they tell you. The latest revelations about the clinic come as the Scottish Government seeks to push through its gender self-ID bill, which would allow 16 and 17 year olds to change legal sex within three months and without medical advice. SNP Minister Ash Regan quit her post so she could vote against the bill. In her first press interview since resigning, the former Minister for Community Safety said the vote should have been free for SNP MSPs, explaining, It's really important that I am able to speak up on issues that are crucial and important for women. We know that in many areas of life, women are discriminated against, and so rightly, they have legal protections in place, and I was not convinced that those legal protections could continue to be upheld. And my conscience would not allow me to vote for a bill where I could not be 100% certain that women and girls would not be in danger.